Well, Kili, normally I would have started this uh, short interview with an Iris-related question, but since the last game, you, since the last official game you've played was at the Euro, and yeah. I assume that that was your biggest moment of your career. I would like to tell us a few things about uh, that experience and uh, the welcome you had from your compatriots when you went back to Georgia. Ah, yeah, it was great, great experience, really crazy experience. It was something like that, that maybe once a life you experience. And uh, for us, for the Georgians, we was waiting so long time for that. And all the country, we were together for this during this time. And it was really great. And when we was feeling this love, this uh, uh, support from our country, it was really crazy and amazing experience. And I'm really thankful for for the God that I I was there. Would you rank that experience as the best in your career so far or not? Yeah, with the national team, it's the best. And in, in general, in, the, in my football career, it's the best experience really that I had until now. Okay, I'm switching back to Aris now. Okay, you are with the team for uh, 10 days now. I see that you already adapt well with uh, yeah. team players. But for the past three seasons, most of these guys were your opponents. Did you have any uh, thoughts uh, about coming and meeting uh, these guys? Look, uh, more or less I knew them from the pitch, really. Three years we are playing already, how many times we played. And uh, of course, we, we after the game, before the game, we had always some small conversations. Some of the guys I was even more closer. And yeah, I knew the club, I knew the guys. And yeah, that helped me to adapt for my adaptation faster than normally needs. And what about the uh, ad adaptation process with uh, the playing style our coach wants uh, to implement? Yeah, that will take time for sure because yeah, it's two different tactics, two different things. What they was, for example, what I was doing in Apoel, and now it's a little bit different things to do. But this is not something that I have not done before in my career. So I know what he's asking and it, it will not take long time. You are now part of an offensive line that besides you includes uh, Coco, uh, Gomez, Zaka. It's going to be a big competition. How do you feel about this competition? This is good. place in the starting no, This is good. When you have concurrence, then every day you ask for yourself more, you do more. And this is good. This is good for the club, first of all. And second for us, for all of us, now we are, we have competition, little competition every day and that, that's really good. Uh -huh. uh, I believe you are four strikers with different elements, uh, each one of you in the game. W what do you aspire to add in Iris offensive line? Uh, Look, I think what they were missing previous years and it was like player who can hold the ball when the team is down and the team needs help to come up. And this was something that what they were missing, and probably this is biggest what coach is expecting from me. And then the player number nine in the box, they all are like more or less, they are playing more from behind, they are going wide, but in the box they, they, they were meeting, missing player. So I think more box striker they were missing. Uh -huh. uh, what, it take, what would it take for you to consider the upcoming season as a success on a personal but a collective level as well. Look, before I signed in Aris, I had meeting with the coach, I had meeting with president, I had meeting with the board, and yeah, I know what is the plan of the club, what the plan is uh, for the future, and, and that's what I liked. And I want to follow for that plan, and I want to achieve the goals what the club has mm -hmm. to win the league, to win the cup, and then Europe. Uh -huh. You are a well-known player in Cyprus. You've been in the country for the past four years, so everybody knows about Vilidaya as a player. But uh, we would like to know a little bit about Vilidaya, the person outside the pitch. How would you describe yourself? In uh, look, to be honest, the people who know me from close, they all telling me that I'm two different person on the pitch and outside on the pitch. On the pitch, I look. Maybe a little bit more arrogant, maybe what the people are thinking, but outside of the pitch I'm 
different, really completely different. And I have here many times that on the pitch you look different person and outside you are different. Uh, One professional guy who is living with football and uh, who loves football and who is doing that all my life and I think in future also I will continue to stay in football. And yeah, I like to have friends and I have a lot of friends now in Cyprus. Cypriots, foreigners, and yeah, now let's see how I will live in Limassol, but Nicosia was that. Thank you very much, I wish all the best. Thanks a lot, thank you.